What's going on people? Welcome back to Curtis Shaw TV, back with another video today and this time more Arsenal transfer talk. Being linked with long-term Arsenal target Osman Dembele, um, the 22-year-old French winger of course is over there in La Liga at Barcelona. They paid £120 million for him from Borussia Dortmund. We were actually linked with him when he was at Dortmund, our old um, scout. Sven Mislintat recommended him to the club. He even quoted him as being a really special player. And um, unfortunately, we weren't able to get the deal done. He went to Barcelona for huge money as part of the you know Neymar to PSG. They then signed Coutinho and Dembele for big money. Um, but it just hasn't happened for Dembele. You know, 19 goals in his three seasons at Barcelona. It's not good enough really when you know your price tag is that high. You expect a lot more than that. Um, the 22-year-old is a great talent, you know, two-footed player, very quick. But it just hasn't happened at Barcelona. Lots of injury problems. He's currently injured for the rest of the season. Um, obviously, we don't know when the season's going to resume, but, you know, suffered a lot of muscle injuries. He's had a lot of criticism over there in Spain for his general conduct. Um, was even said at one stage that he was staying up late at night playing on computer games, so wasn't training very well the next morning. So... His general discipline was questioned. Now, of course, he's very good friends with Aubameyang from his time at Dortmund with him. The two players were very close friends. He's also good friends with Lacazette from the French squad. But to me, at £70 million, apparently Barcelona want to recoup for him. I couldn't see Arsenal spending that kind of money unless they were going to sell one of their front three or front two players in Aubameyang and Lacazette. So... Maybe Arsenal are thinking, you know, do we sell Lacazette and use that money for Dembele? Or are Barcelona, you know, thinking use Dembele as a swap deal for Aubameyang? Um, what would you do? Would you be interested in swapping Aubameyang for Dembele? Would you swap? Uh, would you sell Lacazette, who's being linked with Atletico Madrid again? Would you sell him and buy Dembele? I mean, Dembele, Aubameyang and Pepe, that would be a brilliant front three, but... It strikes me as a deal that will be very difficult to get done now. It seems that Barcelona want to go back and get Neymar. And they're being linked with a few players being sold now. They're saying possibly Coutinho to Chelsea. And possibly Antoine Griezmann leaving as well. Um, I only see maybe one or two of these players going. I'm not convinced they will definitely sell Dembele. And if they do, could Arsenal be at the front of the queue to get him? He's surely going to want Champions League football, something that Arsenal just can't offer at the moment. But maybe, you know, if it's a swap deal, maybe it works for all parties. Now, what would you do in this situation? I, for one, with all this um, coronavirus situation, I don't see um, Dembele um, joining Arsenal, certainly not for £70 million. And, you know, I don't think Arsenal will have that type of cash to spend on one player. Maybe if they got, you know... A similar deal to the deal they got with Nicolas Pepe, which was, you know, sort of buy now, pay later instalments deal. But I can't see a team like Barcelona being interested in that. Um, Dembele has stated a few times before his interest in playing in the Premier League. He said it's a league that interests him. Of course, he was linked with a few Premier League clubs, including Liverpool and Arsenal, when he was at Dortmund. Um, in general, a deal that I think will be very difficult to happen. Um, but not impossible, and possibly if Arsenal were to sell one of their more expensive players, not impossible to do. Um, let me know what you think. Would you take Osman Dembele, £70 million realistic for Arsenal, or are we going to have to sell one of our big hitters in order to make this deal happen? Let me know what you think. If you haven't already, subscribed to the channel. Also, I'm up for the best new content creator at this year's Football Content Awards. There'll be a link in the description below. I'd appreciate it if you could vote. Everyone take care at this state, um, difficult time. Stay safe. I'll be back later in the week. Bless.